That's Mama Luigi to you, Mario. Hi guys, welcome to the review. Um, I, I guess you guys have a pretty clear idea what today's episode is. Luigi! And before I go on a rant about how Luigi is the best of the Mario gang, let's go into the review. Episode 18, Life's Rough. We start this episode off with Luigi heading to a castle. And this is the only episode in the show where it's focused on Luigi. Then we hear someone yell duck. What the heck is happening? The person who yelled duck is King Windbag. He's yelling at a servant because he couldn't tell the difference between a duck and a turkey. And he keeps calling his servant turkey, so honestly, that's on him. How about you stop calling your servant a turkey? That way, nothing will get mixed up. For those of you who don't know why the king is calling his servant a turkey, in the 1950s, turkey was used as a derogatory term for someone who is foolish, slow, and inept. Yeah, I'm kind of glad that that slang died out because the only foolish person is the person who says it like that. <laughs> it just sounds fucking silly. And the poor little mushroom servant is trying his hardest, but he keeps getting yelled at by the king. And I know all this way too much because of fucking retail. One moment you'd be cleaning up the messes the customers made, and then one second later they would have a customer shouting at you. We then find out that the princess sent Luigi to talk to King Windbag because he's acting like a bully to everybody. Yep, that checks out. It sucks we don't actually get Bully Koopa in this episode, but you know what? Hip and Hopper just as good. Then the king complains to Luigi that a dog would be a better servant than the poor little mushroom guy. And due to the king's awful treatment, the mushroom servant says, might as well be so we don't have to deal with your bullshit. Then Hip and Hop overhear this, and their brains hatch an idea. The twins dress up like the little servant guy and surprise attack the king and Luigi. The twins then steal the wand and turn the king and Luigi into dogs. Then the song montage plays, and I think this is one of the worst songs in the show. It's a dog's life. I hated it as a kid, and I hate it now. They then follow the twins into a drain pipe that leads to Miami, Luigi thinks. Turns out it's actually Florida. The two then follow the twins into a hotel, and the twins are destroying the hotel by throwing food at everybody. Luigi and the king try to fight back the twins, but somebody ends up calling the dog catcher, and they end up getting captured. Then the twins hightail out of there to cause more mischief in the real world. At the dog pound, the king starts bullying the dogs, and Luigi criticizes him. Rightfully so. Luigi comes up with an idea to escape through the vent, and the king demands the dog to make a tower to climb up and escape. And Luigi suggests the word please. And we also find out Luigi can speak perfect dog. Please. Then we see the news on a TV and we find out for sure that they're in Florida. And the twins are rampaging through the streets in a sports car. And they're heading off to the space center. Luigi, the king, and all the dogs end up escaping. And they wind up at the space center. The king and Luigi dig underneath the electric fence to gain access to the space center. And the twins end up killing two astronauts for their suits. I don't know why, but this clip here, here is hilarious. Then the king ends up kicking the shit out of the twins, knocking them back out of their suits and stealing the wand back. The king puts the dog catcher in any witnesses to sleep and turns him and Luigi back into humans. They send the twins back to Castle Koopa, and the whole experience teaches the king how to be nicer. He even made a whole feast for his servant. This just shows Luigi's the ultimate problem solver, and that he should get more episodes of his own. This episode's already top tier because of Luigi. Overall, I think it's a great episode. I think the only complaint I have is the song of the episode, uh, It's a Dog's Life. It sounds horrible. I also didn't like the duck and turkey scene, but whatever. That was a really small scene in the episode. This episode, besides the mean-spirited stuff, um, they had a lot of great dialogue and some funny lines. And the ending was just really wholesome. Luigi solves everything. It's pretty convenient how the costuming lined up for today because in about in about an hour or so I'm going to a pop market as Luigi. I'm so excited. Also sadly I think this is the last episode we get the twins starring in their own episode but you know what whatever. Alrighty guys and that's the end of today's episode and yeah Luigi. I love Luigi. Alrighty guys bye bye.